Magical illusions with a movie or still camera. There are plenty that can be created with either. This is one of those now you see me, now you don't surprises. And it's really easy for the movie fan. Of course, the camera was on a tripod. The person being photographed stands absolutely still. The camera is stopped and someone else runs into the picture. Then the camera is restarted. The procedure is repeated as often as desired, and this is the result. Here's the way to solve your food problem right out of the air. With careful planning and one or two rehearsals, it never fails. More camera magic for the still and movie enthusiasts. An eyeglass frame and a small mirror placed this way will certainly change things around. A non-existent lake makes its appearance right outside anyone's front door. This is the movie illusion, and it works the same way in a still photograph. This is another way of doing it with a mirror, aided by two fair bathing girls who prove the age-old admonition, hang your clothes on a hickory limb but don't go near the water, can be done. This time, camera magic makes bathing on dry land a reality. And using the same mirror device, camera magic creates the bearded lady of the circus. Now the movie camera exposes the mirror trick. By merely tilting up, the mirror-made lake gradually disappears, leaving everything high and dry. A handsome man in the palm of her hand. As you see, it's all in how it is staged, with a perspective the most important thing to watch. This illusion explains itself. Next, the girl who lost her head. It may seem impossible, but here it is, and you behold the proof. A troublesome fly adds to the enjoyment when making a picture like this. This illusion requires a little preparation, but time and effort mean nothing to camera magicians. You've probably already guessed this one. Two girls, a little ingenuity, and some real digging in the sand. Here, too, many variations can be made, such as a girl's body and a man's head, or two men, because every camera magician may not readily encounter two beautiful twins at the beach. Here's another that will fit into the circus album, an impossible contortion. Impossible? Not for the film trickster. Simple when you know how to do it, but always startling as a still or movie. This one is strictly for the movie makers. It's the well-known human fly, and it's a sure way to make a man climb the side of a building without ropes or pulleys. It may seem impossible, but here it is, and in reality, it is simple camera magic. All the photographer needs to do is turn the camera sideways while the picture is being made, and another good piece of magic goes into the bag of tricks. Real skill goes with this one, but once it's mastered, it's worth the trouble, as you can see. A stout gentleman saunters behind a tree, and lo and behold, three pretty girls emerge from the other side. Still another girl, and she seems to be followed by our stout man, who has been photographically hidden behind the tree. This illusion is known as the split stage, and it is made by matting out one side of the picture, then reversing the film back to the starting point, and matting out the opposite side. A tree or some other upright object, such as a telegraph pole or lamppost, must cut the scene exactly in half. This picture shows the complete expose. Here's a variation of the almost forgotten goose step. The bird's not a goose, looks more like a jabberwock. Sometimes marching men can do the craziest things with the help of the camera, and sometimes birds can be made to step it up. It's another trick known only to camera magicians. They're off, down the track come pounding hoofs, but it looks as though the cameraman is in control. It's not easy to pick a winner in a scene like this.
Out of the pack comes the dark horse, a horse that can't make up his mind. The advanced amateur can produce this trick with a little help from the optical printer. Imagine two fishermen throwing a bushel of fish into the water. Well, we asked them to because we wanted to expose another illusion for camera magic. While they were tossing the fish from the boat, the camera was turned upside down as we photographed the action, and after the film was developed, this is what we got. It's called reverse action, and an upside down camera is the solution. Many new means of transportation were created during the war, but the didos of this amphibious vehicle are created by the camera. Again, the upside down camera comes to the rescue, and just in time. Jeeps for civilians, not if they're going to act like this. It's amazing what can be done with a Jeep and a camera. If you know how, you can even prevent accidents. Speaking of accidents, here's one that was created on purpose. It appears to be pretty serious, but it can be done without casualties. By simply holding the camera upside down, the accident is staged in reverse, like this, and the doctor is never sent for to finish the scene. This one is another secret of the cameraman who likes to clown around and can figure things out for himself. Fairy tales such as Cinderella lend great opportunities for camera magic. Moving from a close-up, the camera dollies back, which means it is on a rolling platform. For the amateur, a baby carriage will serve as a dolly and will move the camera smoothly and steadily. Deserted by her ugly sisters, Cinderella cleans the pots and pans until an obliging cameraman dissolves in the fairy godmother, who takes pity on Cinderella. Then with her magic wand, she changes the rags and tatters to a beautiful gown bedecked with jewels. This camera trick simplifies the shopping problem for ladies who need new gowns. In reality, it is a series of double exposures utilized by Hollywood producers, but not beyond the possibilities of clever amateurs who wish to create more elaborate effects. Now the motion picture camera, aided and abetted by advanced optical printing, brings to the screen a very energetic drum majorette, who, as she leads the band, multiplies and twists at the will of the operator. It's done with a prism in front of the lens. Sometimes a piece of diamond cut glass will do, or even the scalloped bottom of a small drinking glass. The same girl seven times. Then, by camera magic, she becomes quintuplets. Now she becomes a trio as she continues to swing the baton. It is one of the greatest and most difficult tricks known to camera magicians. If you need further proof of camera magic, here it is. One and the same girl multiplied into two moving columns. Here the skill of the camera magician is at its best.